my name is Jenny Lynn and this is my channel and for today's shorty I am actually painting a really cool really kind of strange commission for my friend Corey he wants me to paint on a Volkswagen hubcap <laughs> So he wants two cars painted, one on either side. And I just wanted to use this opportunity to kind of tell you how I actually go about painting on metal. Because there's quite a bit of preparation involved, but if you do it correctly, your paint is gonna look awesome. So the first thing I did was I actually washed this in the sink because it had a little bit of grease on it. So I used some Dawn dish soap. And then what I did, is I did a line drawing of the two different cars that are actually gonna go on this hubcap. I did a silhouette, so I made my own little stencil. And so I placed the cars on either side of the center here. And I've traced a line, and I'll actually have tape on these. I traced a little line so I know exactly where these cars are going to be positioned. And so then I will use some alcohol and a Q-tip and I will gently clean this area just where I'm going to put paint. I'm not gonna put paint all over the hubcap. And then I'm going to use a little bit of very, very fine steel wool and I'll buff up the area just a tiny bit. You don't need to overdo it in this case because we kind of want a smooth finish so I'm just going to lightly abrade the area that I'm going to prime. So putting on a metal primer or a metal friendly paint is a really good idea. You can get paint that has a rust inhibitor in it so that way rust doesn't come through the paint eventually because sometimes that does happen. After I have the surface abraded I will just paint primer on the area where the cars are gonna be. I'll let that dry and then I will transfer, I will make my own transfer of the drawings and I will make sure that I have all the little details drawn in and then I'll start painting. And I'll be using um, acrylic paints, a variety of different paint. And at the very end, I will put a protective clear coat gloss over top of just the parts that I've painted. So that is the process that I do when I paint on metal. And I find that it works really, really well. And so yeah, now I'm gonna speed this process up and you can watch me and I will show you at the very end what it looks like. So keep on watching.
that's all I got this time. So if you would now please like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and check out all of my links in the description box below. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.